What's up, pups? How you guys doing? I'm doing great. Thanks for asking. I'm, I will never, ever do that to you guys again. So, today is a filming day for Loot Crate video. So, guess what happened to me last week? I filmed a whole bunch of videos for you guys, and what? My computer decided to delete them. I don't know how this happened. This is the first time it's ever happened to me. I literally logged on to the computer, and all of a sudden, all of my videos were gone, including footage for one that I was in the middle of editing. The footage was just, just gone. Does this happen? Because it's a brand new MacBook. Regardless, I'm stuck refilming so many videos, including the one I was editing, so I have to refilm this now. By the way, I didn't open this loot crate before we're getting started here. This is how it arrived to me in the mail. So I'm hopeful that nothing is missing from this loot crate because literally it arrived to me like this. And I was like, what? Did someone want to go through it first? I'm confused. Anyway, you guys, so, Loot Crate unboxing, let's do this. Oh wow, the box is really cute on the inside, so there's all of these drawings when you first open it. It looks like Harley Quinn and the Joker, a bomb, like a, some type of like, Jack in the Box, some skulls, it's pretty cool, right? So if you guys weren't aware, this month's theme is villains, which is super awesome, because I love me some villains. Here's the issue. Okay, and then of course we don't want to continue going through the book because it's just going to tell us what we've received in our box and why do that when we have it right in front of us? So, first thing that I'm pulling out looks like a comic book. Rocket Raccoon comic book! How relevant since the movie's coming out so soon! I'm actually very excited to see Guardians of the Galaxy. How crazy, you guys! Do you see that? Rocket's holding a loot crate! Oh my gosh! How wicked cool! Oh, it even says up here, Loot Crate exclusive. Oh wow, so this is a variant of the comic book that they drew specifically for Loot Craters. That is way cool! Do you see the cool kinds of things that you get when you subscribe to Loot Crate? This is awesome! I'm already freaking out over the first item. Okay, next thing is a t-shirt. And it says... Oh my god. <laughs> it's like... It's like they read my mind. It's two of my favorite villains on one shirt as a mashup. So it says Jokey. So it's the Joker and Loki. And those are like two of the greatest villains in my opinion. This shirt is awesome. I cannot wait to wear this. This is amazing. Oh, 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 Daniel, Daniel, Daniel. That's the first thing I thought of. Oh my God, Daniel, Deadpool socks. <laughs> That's so cool! I love Deadpool! He's amazing! Now I have really cool socks to wear! But what's really strange to me is that I never really viewed Deadpool as a villain. I've always viewed Deadpool as like an anti-hero. Um, so, I mean, yeah, it's cool to get Deadpool socks in the box because I really like Deadpool, but I guess it's like... I guess to me he's just always been an anti-hero. Does anyone else view Deadpool as an anti-hero? Leave a comment down below. Okay, Necessary Evil, Super Villains of DC Comics. This looks like it's some sort of DVD. Oh, it's a documentary. This is gonna be exciting to watch. The Joker, Lex Luthor, Catwoman, Doomsday, Bane. Talks about all of them. Okay, so this looks like it's a poster. <gasps> oh, wow, so cool. I'm like looking at it, not showing you guys. Look at this poster, you guys. I don't know if you're gonna be able to, okay, there you go. So we got Harley Quinn. Look at her, that art is beautiful. And then we have the Joker. This almost looks like the artwork that is on the Black Milk Batman bathing suit. Um, maybe I'm wrong or maybe it's just very similar, but it almost looks exactly like it. But that is way cool. Oh my gosh. And of course it'll it's perforated right here so you can take it apart and frame them. That is so awesome. Ooh, ooh, ooh. It's a Darth Vader keyring. Oh my gosh. Look at it. He's Darth Vader. I don't know why I'm talking like a baby. I have way too many keychains on my keys for my car already, but what's one more in the grand scheme of life? All right, and the last thing in the box is a magnet. I am a sucker for magnets. I love magnets. You should see my refrigerator. Remind me to vlog and show you my refrigerator at some point because it's insane. I love magnets. And this one is Bowser and it says, I want you. No, Bowser. I want you. And that was it. And oh, this drawing. Look at this drawing. Best friends. Oh, I 
love it. I loved everything about this month's box. I hope I'm not missing anything. So t-shirt, comic book, Harley Quinn and Joker poster, Deadpool socks, Darth Vader keychain, Necessary Evil DVD, magnet. Awesome. I got everything I was supposed to get. So nothing was lost in translation when it was opened at the mail place. Great. <laughs> That's exciting. So if you guys are looking for information on Loot Crate, I will have some in the description on this bar below. Just a quick reminder, Loot Crate is a monthly subscription service and they send out geeky, awesome, nerdy memorabilia for you to have and love and cherish. It's $13.37 a month. Clearly you can see that you get some pretty amazing stuff. So like I said, if you're interested, there'll be links down below for you to click. They've also extended to me a code for you to use to get discounts. Make sure you check that out down below. If this is the first video they're seeing of mine, Hi, I'm Kaylee. You should subscribe by hitting that red button down below. We can become best friends forever. Links to my Twitter, Tumblr, Facebook, and Instagram are also down below. I'll see you guys in a few days with another video. Peace out, Trouts!